Actually, today I'm going to read you a story, Pinkalicious and the Princess of Pink Slumber Party. Can you see? Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. Pinkalicious and the Princess of Pink Slumber Party. Having a slumber party. It was not any old slumber party. It was a princess of pink party. Oh, it will be very funny when you do a sleepover like Pink Delicious. Like it will be very joyful. My whole family got ready. Mommy and Daddy dressed up like a queen and a king. Look, queen and. King. Oh, there are very many queens. And Pinkalish is putting a crown for her, her, her mom. I'm the royal prince, said Peter. He grabbed a crown out of my hand. You're, you're more like a jo royal joker, I told him. <laughs> he was trying to get her, her crown, but she said, you look like a royal joker. He means someone is joking kind of thing to someone. Ding dong! The princess are here, I said. I tried to I tried my way to to the door and led by royal friends. Welcome, I said with a cursed enter the castle fair middens. Or is it friends? Oh, maybe coming in here. How grand, Molly said. Molly is her. I'm ready for the ball, Rose said. I mean, Rosie said. Hi, Allison said. Allison said quietly. She... She helped her bear tightly. It means <laughs> she got her bear tightly like this. Yeah, this is my bear. And it has a very good little one. Let's play musical thrones. I start the music and we and we dance, dance around the chairs like we are just crossing some kind of the road like this. <laughs> around the chairs, I didn't even mind being the last, last on the left with a throne. They just, just redid it. Yay, I won, said Molly. Your prize, your majesty, I say. I handed Molly a pink fantastic wand. Oh, this is a wand that usually fairies do. <laughs> it's time to make heroes, I say. Ooh, Rose, Rosie said. Look at the Dazzling jewels. My tear is going to, tw my tear is going to twinkle like a star. Said Molly. Her tear is going to be very twinkle. Oh, and look at this lovely shoes. People are just looking at it. <laughs> look at me! I said. I put my tiara proudly on my head. I have the sparkliest tiara. In all the land. Oh, sh her tiara is very sparkle. Dinner is served, said Mommy. We made a royal fe feast, said Dad. Princess and princesses and the split piece. Split piece. Split piece means what? Let pea soup, split pea soup, chicken, the 
nuggets a la king and and castle cupcakes for dessert oh here is the castle cupcake and a chicken nugget and there's some soup Peter said, if I was royal, we'd always eat desserts first. Yum, I said. That would be a very sweet kingdom. This kingdom, I think this will be very, very sweet. I usually like cupcakes, but it's not good or health. But I just usually eat some, eat some apples or tangerines. After dinner, Peter climbed to the top of a pillow of pillows and yelled, I am king of the castle, like this. <laughs> you can just do like this. But I think, I think there will be something wrong. It's princess, princesses of the castle around here, I said. Princess rule, Molly said. Whoa, they're having a pillow fight, but why is there very really many crowns on it? I mean, some some kind of a feathers. Oh, have a pink crown, a uh, purple crown, yellow crown, and silver crown. Oh, very many colors. Suddenly, I heard a sniffle. It came from Alice. So what's wrong? I asked. I'm scared for sleepover, said whispered in my ear. I gave Allison a hug. Sleeping away from home can be kind of scary, I said. Hmm. What would a real princess do to make Allison feel better, I asked. Protect her from villains, Will said. A princess face her pearls with the stainet. Oh, Molly said. Allison still looked scared. I know, I said. A real princess would have a dragon to protect her. Protect her. Close your eyes, I said. Unlock the magic kingdom. What do you see? Nothing. Said Allison. Look, they close their eyes. What they see, but they they can't see. Can you just just a little bit close your eyes? Can you see something? Maybe the answer is going to be no. It's like but pink color just meaning their thoughts. Listen, I said. Do you hear hear the dragon walking into the enchant forest? That's your dad walking down the hall, Ro Rosie said. Look. That's good in your life. Can you can you just walk around first? Okay. There will be a lot of sound if when you just put on a shoe because because you because you, if when you just put on a shoe and just move on, there will be lots of sounds like kind of, like those, so there will be so many sounds. Brother, I said, do you smell the odor of Dragon breathe in the air. Oh, excuse me, Molly said. I just burped. Oh. <laughs> and Pinkalish thing, the dragon just like in the air. Now, can you just, just slowly down your throat? It gave you a rest. So that means your feel and thoughts can just be calm. Wait, I wait, I said. Don't you hear the loud beating of the dragon's heart? If when you get to another people's and you can just come on your cart and listen, there was some kind of this bumpy sound <laughs> of the dragon's heart. It is my heart, said Rosie. I've never seen a dragon before. <laughs> no. 
open your eyes, I said. The dragon is here. It is pink and it is breathing fire. Look how sparkly its tail is. I see the dragon, Allison said. It is sparkling the moonlight. The moon, the dragon smile. She will protect us, I said. Whoa, dragon. What do you think the dragon's name is, Rose? He asked. Allison yawned. <sighs> Can I tell you the party? I'm so sleepy, Allison said. Good night, princess of pinks. I said, good night, dragon. We all said. Outside the dragon, wait.